Hello and welcome. Today we are playing with our food in Piece of Pie. Piece of Pie is a game for two to four players designed by Trevor Benjamin and Brett J. Gilbert and published by Blue Orange Games. In this game, players take slices from communal pies in order to assemble their own while keeping an eye on the desired patterns and flavors. To set up, the decorations card is placed face up near the play area and one randomly drawn flavor recipe card and pattern recipe card are also chosen and set nearby. Each player will receive one perfect piece card, which is kept hidden from the other players, and then the pie pieces are all shuffled up randomly and then assembled around the starting token. The game is played in clockwise order, starting with the oldest player. On a player's turn, they simply remove a piece from one of the pies in the middle of the play area and add it to their own. The first piece taken from each pie must be the one pointed at by the arrow on the starting token, and all future pieces taken must be adjacent to a previously taken piece. When adding a piece to one's own pie, the reverse applies. There can never be any gaps between pieces. They must always be placed adjacent to other pieces already in the pie. The only slight wrinkle to this is in a two-player game, which we're doing today, where uh, both players make two pies and may start working on their second pie whenever they choose. The game ends once all players' pies are assembled, then the scores are calculated. Each pie earns its player points by matching the criteria shown on the decorations, flavor, and pattern cards. Each player's perfect piece card, meanwhile, earns them one additional point for each instance of the shown ingredient in their pie or pies. And, of course, the player who scores the most points wins the game. Now let's get started. All right, so before we get playing in here, uh, introductions, I'm D. Uh, hi. Yeah, I'm into it today. Okay. Because, look, I've been losing a lot lately. Uh-huh. But if there's one thing I know, uh -huh. it is confectionaries and sweet desserts. That's okay. So I think you're going down today, D. Can we tell your name to the audience? Oh, I'm Will, by the way. Hi, everyone. It's just, just, just the graphic. No, yeah, they, you know. Mm -hmm. Piece of pie. Yeah, we have, we have to play a piece of pie. We gotta play it. Uh, first person is... Me. No, 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 no. Oldest player. Yeah, oh, that's you, actually, yeah. yeah. Yep. You are 48. I guess we should, uh, you know, a couple things. Obviously, the de decorations card, always the same. We've got these, uh, the pattern and flavor cards here. Not in that order, but uh, you can see what we're shooting for. We are going to get four points for each set of uh, ingredients in our pies. Mm -hmm. And two points for having sort of mirror image of the same flavor. You know, you had to explain it to me. So I was like, how is that a mirror image? Wouldn't they have to be on opposite sides to be mirrored? But which, he's like, which they are. Yeah, but they're not exactly, right? But he's, you, you made a good point that if you folded the pie over on itself, yes. they would be laying on top of each other. Yep. You're smarter than me, I'm, I'm saying. I'm not. I, I, I mean, probably, but that's not a good example of why. Anyway, we also right. have our own personal private cards here, which we'll get to at the end of the game. Yeah. So I go first. So I have to start with one of these. Which, one, which is yours? What? You should tell me. I, you no. tell the audience. No. I'm not going to tell the audience. They don't know at the end. There's mine. You know what I don't have now. There's mine. That's, ah. that's Will's. Again, I can choose any one of these four pieces to start with. I'm going to start with this uh, kiwi with a heart on it. Yeah, you have to start picking one of the pieces as yes. an arrow pointing to it. Now you can take either of these or one of those other three. So Trevor Benjamin des designed this game, right? Or he's one of the designers. That is correct, yes. We just played Undaunted last week. Is it also him? It's probably the same guy. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's also Trevor Benjamin. Yeah. And, um, and basketball Hall of Famer David Thompson. Yeah, yeah. so yeah. I don't know who that is. Skywalker. The, that's Star Wars. All right. Um, I'm going to take this one. Oh, you would take that one, you chocolate lover. Okay, so we're making two pies. We're making two pies each. Because it's a two-player game, so yeah. instead of making one pie, we're mm -hmm. making two pies. Let's make two pies. Which sounds amazing, because whenever I eat a whole pie, I'm always like, I, can, I could use another whole pie. And I do eat whole pies. That does sound like you. Yeah. Uh-huh. The uh, chocolate shavings, I never do that. Though. Unusual. Yeah. Not, Frosting, though. I could see it on, like, a chocolate pie. I'll do one pie here, and hopefully another uh, pie here. Yeah, I have to... We'll, we'll move stuff around as we, have, as we make room. Give me that chocolate. Stop saying like this, guy. Give me that chocolate. 
Okay, okay. I can see that. I can see that decision. That's three points there, double icing. If you put icing on a pie, that's genius. I just didn't even know that was possible. You haven't considered the possibility. Honestly, yeah. the only thing I would even think of putting on top of a pie is just like a lattice. But oh, a lattice, like, yeah, yeah pattern? Crust. Yeah, but like... Well, I mean, whipped cream. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess whipped cream is like a... Is like, but icing, like a that's condom. a whole different ball game. Yeah. Was it a buttercream? I don't know. I mean, I can go to Zoom. Anyway, I went, took a strawberry. I'm going to take this strawberry. Interesting. But it's going to be in a different pie. Also interesting. Yes. Okay. Okay. What's your favorite kind of pie? Wa play, but think. At the All same right. Time. So here's the thing. Yes. Are you going to do that thing about I'm like? Gonna, gonna, are you going to be like a British person? American pies are too sweet. No. No. I'm not. I'm going to make a controversial answer. Uh, I'm going to take this first of all. Watch what you say, D. Yeah. Because you know. Because, see, I'm going to say something that people maybe would not think of immediately as being a pie, but I personally consider to be cheesecake. Cheesecake is a cake. Cheesecake is a pie. Cheesecake is a it's cake. It's a tart, but in my mind, a tart's a pie. So, it's a cake. It's, it's literally cake. called a cheesecake. It's, 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 it's in no way a cake. Think about it's it. It's dense agree. like a cake. No. Take your, take your piece. It's dense like a cake. Cheesecake is my favorite dessert, and I believe taking it's a pie. I'm taking this. These are per pie, right? The different symbols? Um, no. Well, they're just per instance. Oh, these. Yeah, yes, these have to yes. be on the same pie. Yes, 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 yes. So it would probably benefit me to put them in this pie. I'm going to be bold. I'm going to say no. Okay, fine. I'm going to say screw the system. I'm doing it my now back way. Back to where we were. What is a pie but a crust with filling? Yeah, but a cheesecake isn't the filling. It is the thing. No, because you get the graham cracker or some other sort of, sort of crust. That's graham the crust. crust. Yeah, that's the pie crust. Mm -hmm. And the cheesy goodness inside is 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 the pie. It's the filling. It's not though. I'm taking this. It's like a cake. The fill. You can actually put filling on a on a cheesecake. You can put like cherry filling on top of it. Now it's a cherry cheesecake. Still a cake. No. Look, I get where you're coming from, because graham cracker crust is an often... I mean, if you got, like, a chocolate pie it's, with a graham cracker crust... It's in no way a cake. It's a tart. But then we're not... It's not pie either. A tart's a pie. All right, by traditional pie standards, give me an answer. Okay. Because I don't like that stupid... We're, we're talking strictly confectionery. I'm talking... Dessert it, pie? It can be... No, it can be savory. Well, then, then pizza, obviously. It's like the best food. That's not a pie! Of course it is! No, what are you if anything, talking about? It's like a flatbread. Pizza pie? That's not a pie! You heard of the word pizza pie? That's not a thing, do you? It's a pizza... It's a dough. It's it's a pie. The, the crust, crust pie, it looks with like toppings. It's it's given the please, colloquial please, name of a pie because a pie. it looks like a pie. Please it's a, not a pie. Please take a piece. Right there. Okay. I don't appreciate. Come on. You, you, I have to narrow it down. Favorite dessert pies uh -huh. served in a pie crust. Okay. God, that's pretty narrow, Will. Um, well, the next thing I know, you're going to be saying like eggplant lasagna or something. Just you're, you're I just, have I have strong opinions clearly on pie, and you're thinking inside the box too much, inside the pie box. All right, taking this. I mean, I'm tempted to say apple, because, I mean, you can't really go wrong with an apple pie. You absolutely right? can go wrong with an apple well, pie. I guess you could if you're, you know, depending on who's making it. But, you know, a properly prepared apple pie. You need to have the right pan if you're going to do the preparation where you actually just throw the raw apple into the crust. Mm -hmm. I'm sure some of you have done this, and it comes out a watery mess, even if you put in something in there like flour to thicken it, it just never ends up right. So in my experience, you have to make the filling and put it into the pie so you get the textures that you want. Mm -hmm. You might notice me getting shorter because I'm having some issues with my chair. Yeah, <laughs> your chair does not it's just, stay I'm, up. I'm, I'm just going to leave it as it is right now. I'm going to take, take this and just start a new pie with it. So this is gonna right. I'm kicking his butt. Told you, D. You're just not pie man. What are my options? You know, I like a, I like a good cherry pie. I know it's controversial, controversial choice, perhaps. You can speak louder. I like a good cherry pie. You like a good cherry pie. Mm -hmm. I thought you were gonna say like Boston cream pie or something. Well, that's a cake. Well, see, this is this is the controversy. We Americans can't get our names right. 
jerk. Uh, D. Mm -hmm. Kiwi pie is my favorite. <laughs> I thought you might say lemon meringue. Lemon no, meringue is a big it's, tang it's, it's guy. It's good. I do like, I like a nice tang. Yes. Uh, With your pie. I yes, mean, of course. Uh, you're a weird dude like that. Interesting. Very interesting. Um, it's placed. All right. So you're not a kiwi pie guy. Really? I've never had a kiwi pie. I didn't even think it was a thing until I opened this box. I know exactly what piece you want. Uh-huh. As you should. It's yeah. Not, it's, not. <laughs> it's very obvious what piece you're waiting. <laughs> and it's pissing me off. Right there. Nah. I'm just going to tell you, Will. I'm almost certainly going to get the one I want. Uh-oh. What, did you do the math in your head of well, like... I mean, we're, we're, I go second well, last. Well, no, I should, I should move. You should keep it. And you go last, which means you're going to go third last. Right. So you're saying no matter what, I can't hold out? I can't imagine how you could. This always happens. Did you tactic that? Because mm. <laughs> your brain's too good if it did. Did I say what my favorite kind of pie was? Mm, I don't. I don't believe you did. No. I, I, honestly, the best tasting pie I've ever had. It was a peanut butter mousse pie, and it had a whipped cream topping made from scratch. And it was at this like church event thing I went to, mm -hmm. and there was no chocolate. It was just peanut butter central. Peanut butter central sounds pretty good. <laughs> peanut butter central. That was the high school. I went to peanut butter central high. Good times. What do you take? The blueberry? Blueberry with some chocolate shavings, because you know, what does pie need more? What do American pies need more than some more sweet? What's your favorite hmm? movie mm. with the name pie in it? I know what everyone's thinking. I can only think of one. I can, th well, I can think of a series where that word is mm -hmm. featured. Um, uh, as far as others, though, I'm, I'm, I'm struggling. Yeah. Um, so for me, it would probably be Life of Pie. I don't, does that count? I didn't say the spelling had to be the same. I'm surprised you haven't seen that film. I have. <laughs> Genius. So is this just two points for every instance of a mirror? Yeah. All right. Well, at least that gets me another instance of one. What did you just do? Took the last two, you can go there. Ah, oh, you. Did we mess up? How? Oh, no, no, no. I have. Yeah. I'll have two spots left. You'll have two spots left. All right. How have we messed up? There's only. So I many honestly don't know. I just. I had a moment there, and this is. You're making me look smart, guy. I get what I need. I mean, obviously, I'm going to take that. Okay. <sighs> You're a jerk. It's only why I got one good pie. And then you get the red. All right. Our pies are made, Will. Now we got to figure out who won. Because I actually don't know. Can I have my pies and eat them, too? Uh, I wouldn't recommend eating them, necessarily. I, I don't think that would end well. So, um, okay. All right. You're doing that. I guess we should just, yeah, let's start with decorations, mm -hmm. and then special objective right. things, and then... So, decorations. Delicious. Got two, three, one, two, three, four, five. I got seven chocolate. Seven, so that's seven points. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get three, uh, I'm going to get six more for the frosting. So How? One here and one here. Oh, yeah, there's three each, sorry. So and it's then, uh, 13. Yep, five for the set of the things, which I have one of there. So it's 18. 18 points, D, you get for decorations. Good decorations. Not bad. Congratulations. Yeah. What about you? Oh, well, for me for decorations. Yeah. Uh, chocolate. One, two, three, four, five on that one, and then one. So six, six for those. And you also get six for the frosting. One, two, one, two, one, two. So I did it three times. No. Yes. You did it twice. No. 
Because look, pair, yeah. pair, yeah. pair. So that's nine Three plus pairs. six no pairs. is 15. Yes. Plus? I have one set right so, here. Okay, so you get so 20? It was nine plus six plus five. Yeah. 20. Hey, you're winning. I'm winning. I'm going to win the game. All right. Next up, we have these uh, these sets of flavors. Mm. I've got eight points from that. I got two sets in this. Wait, what? Oh, you do. Mm -hmm. You also, I think, get the same amount of points. I didn't realize you could do it more than once per pie, but you're right. You yeah. can. Yeah. I, I mean, I didn't remember you can do it that. Yeah. But I did it twice as well. So we both get eight points. Eight points from that. Well, I'm still in the lead, guy. You might have me here, guy. I'm just going to say it. Mirrored pieces. Actually. Well, you haven't done great on this. <laughs> How do you know that? Well, I mean, well, maybe you have. I've done all right. It's a little messier than mine, but yeah, yeah. you did all right. So we get two points. So obviously I'm getting the full uh, full uh, eight points here. How are those mirrored? And they're on the other side. Why do you think I assembled it like this? It's mirrored. Wait. <laughs> what? You're telling me that this was all mirrored pieces. Uh, yeah. Not just the ones that are mirrored two spaces away from each other. It's not two spaces. No, yeah, because look at this. This shows. Look, look at the arrows. Look at the boldened ones, right? Yeah, that's just an I example. I didn't see the faint arrows. There's a glare in the card where I'm sitting. Wait, are you telling me? No! I still think you're going to win. Hold on. How could you mess that up? Hold on. There's something you get points out of that. We haven't done this pattern one yet. What? Divide your pie in half. Score two points for each pair on the same flavor located as mirror images of each other. Mm hmm. Oh, I thought it was just the ones that were like the bold ones. Because that's why my pies are ugly. Because I was trying to get them two spaces apart like every single time. No. Anyway, so I get eight points from this one. Yeah, because you have one, 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 mm -hmm. one, 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 one. And, so, and this one, I got these blues here. So that's four. Yes. Yeah, so. And then I got these kiwis here. Mm -hmm. But now I also have these two blues here. Yeah. Would that count as well? I'm assuming it would. Aren't they? Oh, no, these aren't. These aren't. My mistake. No, it says literally you would take the pie, split it in half, and you'd have to choose the splitting point. So where are you mirroring? Oh, mirroring it? you think that's how it goes? Probably. Well, you would have to. You can't okay, just like fine. keep mirroring. Fine, fine, fine. So I get I get uh, twelve but, total points then. All right, because the way I thought, I thought it always had to be two apart. So these are mirrored, right? Yes. And then these would be mirrored, but they wouldn't be, because I misunderstood the well, rules. They would the, the strawberries would be mirrored. It depends on what, how you fold it, I guess. What would get me the most points? I think if you be, fold it like this way. It'd be the, these the two. The blueberries and, and the, the peaches. peaches. Yes. So that's what I'll take. Yeah. That's two sets. That's four one. points. Yeah. Then over here, I did the same thing. You think you get another four? I get, get another four. Four, yeah. Because these two. These sets right here. Uh, no, sorry. These sets. These and this and this. Uh oh. Well, yeah. Well, it doesn't matter how I do it. No matter what, it's four. Yeah. So, yeah. So eight points. Eight more points. So what are we up to? You have 36. I have 38. 38. You're going to beat me. Well, what was your secret card? Well, that's the last thing to do. Secret card. How many did you get? Three. three. So you have three. Mm -hmm. And then I got one. Two, well, six. I got six total. Wow. Are you serious? So 26, 30, 41. Mm -hmm. And then mine was... 42. 42? You did the right <laughs> point. We already won! The streak is over. All it took is I'm, sweets. It took sweets. <laughs>And I think you had one play in Kitchen here. Kitchen Rush is actually, I think. You had game. one play during this game. I don't even think it was intentional, but you made it so that I couldn't get a strawberry. And I, I was like, oh, no. <laughs> well, how could it be intentional? It's not like I knew you well, had no, strawberries. Well, no, I know, but I knew because, like, I knew, like, going, like, for, like, the rest of the game, it was going to be hard for me to get strawberries at that point because of, like, the, the, the back and forth we were in. So I was like, uh-oh. But, yeah, that was it. That was the difference. It was tactics is what it was. Your fondness for peach. And apparently strawberry because I drew a yeah, lot more of those than you did. took more of those than I did. Wait a second, I actually had kiwi. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I lost again. It's a magic trick. <laughs> uh, yeah. Hey, Will. Hey. You did it. It means you clean up. Yep. Can I eat the pie now? You, I do not eat the pie. It's cardboard. Thank you for watching this video, ladies and gentlemen. If you enjoyed it, uh, and we hope you did, please like, comment, uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And uh, you can, of course, hit the notification bell. 
uh, so you uh, get the immediate uh, notifications when our videos come out. And our social media is linked to below, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, if you want to follow us on any of those. And you can come back uh, next, it should be Wednesday, hopefully next Wednesday, for our review of Piece of Pie. So, uh, I think that might do it, though, for today, Will. Anything else? Will? Yeah, I want to, there's two things I want to say. Okay. Great. Say thank you, Blue Orange Games. Yeah, thanks a lot for... For sending this, as well as a few others. Uh, yeah, you might have noticed we've been playing a lot of their games recently. It's not a coincidence. Uh, and also, thank you, Trevor Benjamin and Brett J. Gilbert, the designers of this game, mm -hmm. and the artist as well, uh, Maureen Kasuli, because now... I know you can put icing on pies, and it's, you know, it's completely socially yeah. acceptable. I guess just around the tips, the center. I'll do the whole thing. Yeah, you would. Well, what about pies that are completely glazed? Like Drake's pies? Oh. I mean, in a way, a glaze is not far off from an icing. I, I mean, guess. essentially, it's powdered sugar and sure. whatever they put else in it to make I it stable. I feel like Drake's pies are more of a burrito. <laughs> more of like a pasty, a <laughs> pocket. Yes. Okay, we're going to ramble on about pies for another 20 minutes, yeah. but you guys can go. Yeah. So until next time, see Bye. ya.